Hello and welcome to Storytime. I've got Mr Bear with me today and he's very tired because he didn't have a very good night's sleep. Lots of things kept waking him up and now he's very sleepy. I know a story about another bear who had trouble getting off to sleep. Would you like to hear it? It's called Peace at Last by Jill Murphy and published by Macmillan. The hour was late. Mr Bear was tired. Mrs Bear was tired. And Baby Bear was tired. <gasps> so they all went to bed. Mrs Bear fell asleep, but Mr Bear didn't. Mrs Bear began to snore. <sighs> went Mrs Bear. Oh no, said Mr Bear. I can't stand this. So he got up and went to sleep in Baby Bear's room. Baby Bear wasn't asleep either. He was pretending to be an aeroplane. Meow, <coughs> went Baby Bear. Meow. <coughs> oh no, said Mr Bear. I can't stand this. So he got up and went to sleep in the living room. Tick tock went the living room clock. Cuckoo! Cuckoo! Oh no, said Mr Bear. I can't stand this. So he got up and went to sleep in the kitchen. Trip, trip, went the leaky kitchen tap. Hmm, went the refrigerator. Oh no, said Mr Bear. I can't stand this. So he got up and went to sleep in the garden. Well, you would not believe the noises there are in the garden at night time. Twit twoo! Twit twoo! Went the owls. Schnuffle, schnuffle. Went the hedgehogs. Meow! Went the cats on the garden wall. Oh no, said Mr Bear. I can't stand this. So he got up and went to sleep in the car. It was cold in the car and uncomfortable, but Mr Bear didn't even notice. He was so tired. He was just falling asleep. When all the birds started to sing and the sun started to shine. Tweet, tweet, went the birds. Shine, shine, went the sun. Oh no, said Mr Bear. I can't stand this. So he got up and went back into the house. In the house, Baby Bear was fast asleep and Mrs Bear wasn't snoring anymore. Mr Bear got into bed and closed his eyes. Oh, peace at last, he said to himself. <coughs> Went the alarm clock. <coughs> Mrs Bear sat up and rubbed her eyes. Oh, good morning, dear, she said. Did you sleep well? Not very well, dear, <sighs> said Mr Bear. Never mind, dear. I'll bring you a nice cup of tea. And she did. Oh, poor old Mr Bear. He didn't have a very good night's sleep at all, did he? Well, I'm hoping that my bear will have a better night's sleep tonight. I've got him this eye mask. I'm going to pop it on and hope that that will help him to stay asleep. Thank you for joining me today and I hope you can come back again another time.